Today we are at a motor circuit. We are about 70 kilometers away from Bucharest and uh, Honda has brought all of their toys over here for us to play with. Basically, almost their entire lineup. They invited a bunch of people and uh, they provided the circuit for us. So everything from the small Rebel to the larger Rebel, which is hiding over there somewhere, the CRF 300, the beautiful Goldwing, a bunch of Africa twins, all of them are here for us to have fun with. But before any of that fun could be had, and also by looking at everybody's very excited faces, we first had to sit through a safety briefing. You might remember Bogdanov from uh, other internet-related things. Uh, he also started an OnlyFans. You said he started an OnlyFans site as well. He's one of the instructors here today. He's, uh, <laughs> he takes... He takes part in a lot of Moto RC sports, so he's here to teach us how to actually ride properly on uh, on the circuit. Which one do you think, out of all of Honda's toys today, which one do you think I'm more most interested to ride? I think two the, guesses, two of them. The Golding Bagger. It seems like a proper bike for you to ride because uh, you, my, my you, age. You are not about the age. <laughs> it's not about age related right now. Okay. It's what about is? your style and uh, the way that very sporty. you look on a bike. Yes, it's a very sporty bike. It's and like with this <laughs> bandana stuff on your head. And okay. All right. And the other one? The eyes, the blue eyes. They work very well with the gold wing. And the other one, I think you the CRF250 would be nice for you to ride. No. You will look like a monkey. You will look like <laughs> the bear from the circus. You're not going to guess it. The scooter, the 350 ADV. So, on track with the scooter, yeah. it will be nice. It's a, it's a fun It's bike. got the huge wheels, so it's very good on, on track. It will, it will react very nice, you will like it. Trust me. You will, you will even have the chance to pass somebody <laughs> at some point. Okay. I'll make you proud. <laughs> Please do. I ho, let's go, let's go. Vă mulțumesc! It has been quite a while since I've been on the Goldwing. It's definitely not a bike that is, uh, that's made for the circuit. But uh, since I reviewed, I think it was a 2020 model, I've realized that the moment you put it in sport mode, everything changes. And uh, it's also a very agile bike very you don't you look at it you think it's a tank it is not a tank this center of gravity that it's got it's so low down six cylinders boxer it's just it's beautiful i love it uh, speaking of sport uh, let's put it on to sport it changes absolutely everything about the bike oh my god <laughs> and that was slow it's like a rocket that wants to take off. Look how far you can lean it. Just look at that. It's mental. Engine braking for days. There's a guy on a CRF 300 there. That's He's setting the speed on a circuit. And I'm sitting on a 1800 cc's of Goldwing. I wasn't paying attention in the briefing if I'm allowed to overtake or not, but... Uh, not gonna stop me. Look at that CRF go. How, how fast are we doing? 120, 130. Hello, Mr. CRF. It's a scooter. How do you turn it on? What? I'm with a scooter on a circuit exactly the way it should be. I think I should make a new series called uh, Unnatural Things. It's like Stranger Things, except uh, 
There, it's in Romania and it's made by me. Up ahead there is uh, is the marshal and apparently not allowed to sit behind him, obviously. But I'm uh, I'm on a 28 uh, horsepower, not CC. It's a 350 CC, 28 horsepower scooter. All right, okay. Brakes brakes are not the same <laughs> as on the Goldwing, so. Uh, Let's go a bit slower. On the right hand side you've got the front brake, obviously on the left hand side you've got the rear brake and that's it. No riding modes, no nothing. I mean when I heard 28 horsepower I <laughs> expected it to be like really really lazy but it's not. It's very stable. It goes into the corners quite well. I'm not sure about the wheel size. I'll put that on screen, but it's quite stable. I like it. I like it a lot. I think this would be really worthy for a full-on review because with the way the price of gas is going up, uh, I think scooters, at least in Europe, they're gonna they're gonna be quite embraced by everyone. And here comes the straight. Hundred and two, hundred and four, hundred and twelve, hundred and fifteen, hundred and twenty two, hundred and thirty k's an hour. That's it. That's, I'm not going any faster on a scooter. Let's try and overtake the Goldwing with a scooter. Get him on the straight. On the straight. No, no. Ah. Completely wrong line, but we did it. Hello, Rebel. This is the 1100 Rebel based exactly on the engine of the Africa Twin. It's the Big Boy Rebel. Even though it's the same engine as the Africa Twin, they uh, they have remapped it differently, so it only puts out around 87 horsepower now, instead of the 100, uh, 102 of the Africa Twin. <laughs> it's still got plenty of low down grunt, just like the AT, but it gives it to you a little bit differently. It's a little vibey at lower RPMs, but uh, I think that's just its uh, its character. The sound is wonderful as well. The seating position is definitely uh, quite different than what I'm used to. Your legs are quite forward, so cruiser guys are <laughs> going to enjoy that quite a bit. Um, I don't know. It's it's a weird position for me. I'm not. I'm used to the more uh, more adventure style, but uh, if you're a fan of cruisers, this will be natural to you. Straight! <laughs> With the seating position and the grunt of the engine, uh, and the looks of it, this bike definitely has character. It's been a wonderful day so far here. Uh, I would have hoped to ride a lot more bikes, but uh, these kind of exercises are actually quite useful to teach you or uh, for you to test a lot more models in one single day. So uh, well done Honda on, uh, on organizing this. Test riding a bike is always extremely important before you buy it and uh, coming to one of these track days where you can jump from one to another to another to another to actually figure out uh, which one better suits you is just wonderful. So uh, well done on organizing that. If you've enjoyed this content, like, subscribe, share and uh, I'll see you on the next one. Mm -hmm.